So LaMichael just finished year three in the NFL. He's a restricted free agent now after being traded from San Francisco to Miami. Kenyon, Kenyon completed year two in the league after being swapped from Carolina to Philadelphia, reunited with Chip Kelly on a futures contract now with the Eagles. But it's that gravitational pull back to Oregon that has both former Duck backfield mates choosing to spend a chunk of their offseason right here in the Beaver State. Golden, yeah. take your time, get in your center. We train outside yeah, the box overhead. and so far outside the box. We've been able to draw uh, the cadre of different athletes. Nice. Not a box, but a converted horse barn on the top of a hill yeah. in West Lynn. So I want you to meet it, suck it back like it's a shock absorber. I'm not exactly the softer side of Sears. Uh, I do tie in um, the mind, the body, and the diet. Hey, give me a hand. That's where Dave Shalofsky makes his way, and pro athletes make their hay. Hey, give me a stiff arm. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. You know, at first, you know, uh, I was sitting courtside at a Blazer game, and uh, I meet this one guy. He, like, introduced me to Dave. You know, he said Dave was a trainer, you know, so Dave was, like, persistent. Like, hey, come train, you know? I'm, so I'm leaving at 9. He's like, well, we can train at 6. You know, I'm like, dang, he's intense. Let's go. Up. You'd expect intensity from the former California cop and MMA fighter who trained local UFC star Chill Sonnen. But Coach Dave brings a whole new meaning to running tires during the NFL offseason. Spin around me, spin around. The former University of Oregon running backs, Michael James and Kenyon Barner. What makes what he does work so well for you? The results. Uh, you know, you come out here and it's completely different from what you would typically see from a training session. You know, I'm used to squatting you know, power cleaning, you know, the normal training stuff that you do at a normal facility. I think it builds character, honestly. You know, being here in, uh, in Oregon, you know, where I play college ball, uh, not really a lot of distractions. No distractions, no heavy weights. The stable is sparse, but the key is connecting mind, body, and balance, building those fast twitch muscles. I vibe tremendously. I mean, I remember first coming in here and I was just like, I can't do none of this stuff. And, uh, you know, it's still kind of that way, you know, but you got to keep fighting and keep pushing, you know, it's something that we're not used to, you know, you just don't want to continue doing one thing in life. I feel like I've been doing squats all day. Some things have changed in life. Barner and James both have baby boys with their girlfriends back here in Oregon. And it's the coaching by Dave that keeps them cradled and coming back to the state they starred while at the U of O. We definitely have a connection here. You know, we always like to come back. You know, I've always liked Portland and, uh, I really do enjoy being here. You know, the people are great, uh, food's great, you know, everything's great. So, you know, I just want to come back here, you know, and just keep working and keep training. I consider it to be home away from home. You know, California, where my family is, that'll always be home. But this has become my home over the past five, six years. You know, the time that I spent here is irreplaceable. Good, nice power on that. Clean and sober for a decade, Jalofsky hosts free clinics for kids and is a strength and conditioning coach for the Lions football team, wrestling, lacrosse, baseball, even cheerleading. His son is a freshman at West Lynn. And Dave pleads that anyone, anywhere, at any time can exercise down at the need of a high-priced gym. The tire's got to cross by itself, and you got to stop. He's got to stop on his own. You it doesn't matter if you live in an inner city or if you live in Lake Oswego. It really doesn't matter. You don't need a gym membership to be in shape. You don't need a gym membership to eat correct. You don't need a gym membership to know not to drink alcohol, not to take drugs. What you need is a, is a mindset to get better and to strive for perfection. You don't have to reach it, you just have to strive for it. Some good dudes there. DeAnthony Thomas, now the Kansas City Chiefs, also checks in with Dave. We appreciated the invite out there as well.